location to stimulate the, stimulate the emission of radiation. Many of you guys know what these devices are called by their other name. This device is called light amplification to stimulate the emission of radiation. Laser. Exactly. Okay. Why? It is a laser light, and because of how they make lasers, there is only one color of light in here. That's why it moves straight. Can you guys see the laser beam between me and the ceiling? Yeah. No. Barely. No. Sort of. Barely. Sort of. No, well, look at the wall. Can you see the spot on the wall? Yes. I can. That beam's not as bright as the spot, is it? No. Let's go ahead and put something in the. Oh, just a second. Light travels in straight lines. You can't see the light between me and the wall because there's nothing for it to bounce off of. We put something there. It'll be a little weird. I can see bouncing on here. Oh. When we put the smoke in, it has something to bounce off of. That's all smoke. Now, when light bounces off surfaces, it always bounces smoothly. It bounces off at the same angle that it hits. If Heather throws this bouncy ball straight down at the ground, it goes straight back up. If she throws it at a glancing angle, it comes back at the same angle she threw it. I do have a lot I want to get through, and these are some kind of cool principles. I can show you guys some really cool demonstrations of light as long as we're willing to keep going with them. But I'm really excited about some of these. Now, light is just like that bouncy ball. Would you hold it pointer for me? If I... Oh, I know this. Hit it, 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 if I shine the laser straight down with the plate, it bounces straight back up. If I shine it at a glancing angle, paper plates and fancy ribbons, they have canned smoke too. Yeah, it's canned smoke. Why don't you make your own? Where did you get the laser? The laser? Well, you get these from stores that sell lasers. 